Capillary blood collection is a highly skilled procedure that provides another way to acquire blood specimens for the laboratory examinations that assist healthcare providers in their assessment and treatment of patients. The need for standardization of a capillary blood collection procedure is apparent when facilities have recollections which affect timeliness of results, treatment, and patient satisfaction. If done incorrectly, a simple capillary blood collection procedure can result in unacceptable specimens and inaccurate results. The GP42 standard describes the process and related procedures for collecting diagnostic capillary blood specimens, including capillary blood gases. It is intended for healthcare professionals responsible for obtaining specimens from patients, as well as for manufacturers of capillary puncture and incision devices and microcollection containers. GP42 also establishes requirements for single-use disposable devices for collecting, processing, and transferring capillary blood specimens, including those for point-of-care testing. This standard does not cover capillary puncture procedures for self-testing, nor does it cover procedures for point-of-care testing. Several changes were made in this edition. One of the principal changes is content reorganization to reflect a process composed of multiple procedures, consistent with the incorporation of quality management system principles into CLSI documents. This standard provides sequential procedures that make up the process of successful, safe capillary blood specimen collections. The Quality System Essentials, or QSEs, are foundational building blocks that function effectively to support the laboratory's path of workflow. Adherence to the QSEs ensures that collection is performed at a higher level of overall quality. Other changes include provision of greater detail on patient identification, registration, and specimen labeling processes. This information has been updated to align with the second edition of CLSI document GP33 on accuracy in patient identification. Revision to identification of proper puncture sites. Here, Limitations for capillary puncture site selection are discussed and rationales are provided for sites that must not be used, sites that require physician permission, and sites that should be avoided. Expansion of patient positioning instructions. Recommendations for seated, recumbent, and assisted positioning are provided. Newborn collections are also discussed. A quality management system is the best way for laboratory operations to fulfill quality requirements and objectives. The QMS can be divided into 12 QSEs, which are foundational building blocks that function effectively to support the laboratory's path of workflow. All laboratory personnel should know, understand, and be able to describe the QSE activities that pertain to their job responsibilities and apply them as required to operate within the standard of care. An overview of the QSEs that pertain to the collection of blood specimens by capillary puncture is presented in this version of GP42. GP42 provides guidance for collection of capillary blood specimens that accurately reflects a patient's clinical status, ensures the patient's physical safety, and facilitates harmonization among all healthcare professionals in a facility. By applying the standardized process and procedures described in GP42, facilities may recognize a decrease in the number of recollections and an increase in the timeliness of results, having a positive impact on treatment and patient satisfaction. CLSI thanks you for your interest in our standards and guidelines.